Narcissists employ a lot of manipulation tactics, however, gaslighting is one of the main ones where they will try to make you doubt your perception of reality. Now, if you are ever in doubt of the actual person that you are dealing with, look no further than the Cheshire Cat Grin smirk that they will have on their face whenever they try to instigate drama or they try to harm you intentionally. Understand that when you're dealing with a narcissist, you're not dealing with someone that is naive. Narcissism is not a type of knowledge impairment. It is a type of empathy impairment. They lack empathy. Hence, this means that you are dealing with someone that will harm you and they will not care. And this is because they do not have the ability to truly put themselves in other people's shoes. You are dealing with people that are highly sadistic, which means that they take pleasure in causing you pain, humiliation, and discomfort. Understand that when you're dealing with a pathological narcissist, you're dealing with someone that is rooted in their shame, however, they are unable to move past their pride. And this is why they are so toxic. This is because they only have access to negative emotions. Understand that when we're talking about pathological narcissists, the shame that we're talking about here is not healthy shame. It is dysfunctional shame. And pathological shame essentially is pathologically low self-esteem. Self-esteem so low that they would probably have to look up to see it. Simply put, the person that you're dealing with today is an adult bully. And who is an adult bully? An adult bully is an abuser. You are dealing with people that are based in shame and they're unable to move past their pride. Hence, the only way in their world that they can feel better about themselves is for them to drag other people down to their level. When you truly understand who pathological narcissists are, you will see that you really need to get the courage to walk away and stay away. You will have to go completely no contact or low contact if you have children with this person or, you know, some type of familial relationship where there needs to be some level of communication. However, understand that you really cannot have a positive, healthy, growing relationship with pathological narcissists as they embody destructive energy. Narcissists do not want your love, kindness, or compassion. They want your attention, validation, admiration, and your reflection. They want your energy.